Happy National S.P.K. Day. July 25th. Now you may realize, you may be aware, just a couple days ago, we celebrated National Sour Candy Day, July 18th. We ate some Warheads and we opened the Wally Warhead Bunko Pop, of which there's only one. I did the research, I did the deeper, deeper dive, and it turns out... National Sour Candy Day, July 18th, was started by Sour Patch Kids. National Sour Patch Kids Day, which I think is falling into obs obscurity. This may be the only day we celebrate such. It was actually created by 7-Eleven. So if we do this again, if they make more, if they ever, if Funko ever does the right thing and makes an affordable green, we'll do, we'll, we, we, we will have a look on... Uh, National Sour Candy Day. Well, there's a lot to do here. There's a lot to do right now. Cuts. I got the two newest, new to me, Funko Pops. Way back March 2019, I unboxed the initial four. Even then, I was like, where's green? Where in the world is green? Because we, we had the bag of this typical standard regular, which had been around since 1985, which has green in it. Where's the green? Funko, did you make green? Yes, they made a green one that limited edition of 1000 Emerald City Comic Con exclusive. I looked at eBay just now. There is one that listed. I get this 800 doll hairs. Insane insanity. Uh, so that's, that's one of the most egregious, stupidest things Funko has ever done. Right up there with not releasing the blue <laughs> uh, Otter Pop. Look at this. Uh, rainbow, no green. Okay, what's new? What's next? I got the grape. It's sugar exclusive. Now, on National Junk Food Day, which I think was July 21st, I talked about the It's Sugar store in New York City, which has a jelly bean, Statue of Liberty. And then in 2020, New York City got a... Sour Patch Kids store. So far, the world's only Sour Patch Kids store, and they are just lacking on merchandising. Of course, you can go, you can come in and taste all the flavors, and there is a large Sour Patch Kids Statue of Liberty, but there's no merchandise of that besides a T-shirt, maybe a box, figures, uh, keychains, pins, magnets. Sour Patch Kid, Lady Liberty, make it happen, and the the SBK store sells all these Funko Pops still, except the green, except the green. Okay, so I got a fat opportunity for you, Funko and SPK. Re-release the green as Lady Liberty, SPK store exclusive. So at least we can complete our rainbow and also hashtag Liberty Insanity. These are really good. I'm a fan. I'm going to have to do it like this because of the gap. Yeah, these are real good. Now, who's that? Who are you? That is Strawberry. Let me introduce you to the second most stupid thing Funko has done concerning these dudes. See, there's, there's Red Berry. One. Lemon, two. Orange, three. Blue Raspberry, four. The gap in between, I think, is basically the... I, mean, I think it's Wally Warhead and the Peeps. And for some reason, I did not get a bag of strawberries. Maybe they don't make a bag of straight strawberries. Here's some blue for fun. Nor did I get a bag of standard typical regulars. Been around since 1985 in the U.S. And why aren't the grape ones shaped like the, the Mars Man? Allegedly they originally came from Canada and they were called the, the Mars Man. But because of the success of the Cabbage Patch Kids and the Garbage Pail Kids, when they threw them down the border to the United States, they started calling them Sour Patch Kids. Begun 1985, same year as Warheads. Sour Patch Kids, sounds like Garbage Bell Kids, SPK, GPK. Airheads, dude, same year, 1985, looks like Atom Bomb. Garbage Bell Kids. These are called Heads. Two flavors in one. 
Big boys. They could mix two flavors in a regular size. So we, you know, the Tic Tacers can do a funny photo shoot right here like this. They're doing the tug of war. Eh. Green. Nope. It's sugar and SBK store exclusive strawberry. This is going to blow your mind. And uh, if your name's Toy Insanity, you're going to be forever angry about this. Also, who does that look like? Look exactly like the red berry, aka cherry. There is effectively the slightest shade different in color. The base of this one says 2020. The base of this one says 2018. Okay. On the shelf, though. Anyone who sees it is going to be, why did you get two of the same? They're not the same. That's your red berry and that's your strawberry. When all they had to do, okay? Let me go ahead and support your decision to make that flavor into a figure instead of doing the right thing with the green. Okay? All you had to do was the other sculpt. Left arm up. Right arm up. Right arm up. Why wouldn't you do the strawberry right arm up? No. The two newer additions to the collection are both left arm up. Now, I have a plan. Hopefully we can get this done by this time next year. I'm going to buy an extra yellow. Okay? And I'm going to buy some Rit dye. And I'm going to dye the translucent plastic yellow one green. Say I won't. Okay? It's not going to look like the ECCC one. Because guess what? The ECCC boy is left hand up. But it should be fine. It should be fine to me. And me knowing that I've completed the rainbow, I've tasted the rainbow. Sweet, sour, insane, gone. If it has the wrong hand up. Now, these are called cola. Very good. Now, let's say... The camera's messing up. I can't do anything. I have to do those like that. Then you... Then you... That's odd and awkward already. Green will be the same. Blue, purple. So when I make my custom green next year... It'll look like this. Left arm up, left arm up, right arm up, right arm up, right arm up, left arm up, left arm up. So the three right arm ups will be in the middle. That is fine. Funko. Money on the table. Money on the toy candy. The Funko plastic vinyl collectible table. Make a green. An affordable green for the people. And or, and or, and or. A Statue of Liberty SPK. New York City Comic Con exclusive. Okay. Or, and, or, and, or, SBK Superstore exclusive. I've been your host, Tony Sanity. Thumbs it up. Hope you enjoyed. These are good flavors. Everybody likes SBK. Everybody in the whole world. Okay? Sorry for the ranting. Sorry for the ranting. Raving. Sorry for the equipment failure. That's what this channel has come to.